infrastructure and the military mono nca office a credit guitar center a yet fiber optic cable and it's satellites at mahama sino ghana digital applications and it's our applications now almost build the yeah and the almost the tool area and so data center and so and the government to government government to business government to citizen and to a buying conference it many a buying office didn't come on as sending their emails as sending their scan copies of documents and a banks it to me did digital check credit card atm a yeah a yeah momo and the ninja nano john mahama we know this annual ninja nano is see data and so and the infrastructure no any holding your mano and a head and cable no epic census no and all send information the bremo moment could you mama do about me on digitization sa interview we will be bremo share now muntian the level of reasoning when it comes to digitization this is mahamudu baumia key to all the things you mentioned uh is leadership uh one step forward, it always feels like one step forward, four steps back. Um, how do we do this on a consistent basis? I think you are very, uh, you've touched on a very important point because it's, it's, it's important that you have leadership, uh, selfless leadership, um, because for, for what I've been looking at this whole issue, why we've taken so long, 60 years after independence to really address some of the fundamental issues that I've been talking about, the systems, why we've lived with all these problems for so long and not really had um, that leadership to solve the, these problems. Our, our leadership has tended to focus on crisis management. <laughs> Successive governments is like, oh well, oil prices have gone up, you have a crisis, commodity prices, and, and, and political instability, macro instability. That seems to be the focus, crisis management. We've not looked, leadership hasn't focused on the underlying system that drives economic activity. And, and so when you look at this, this question, you need to think about the future. For the politician, generally, the horizon is so short. You are in office for four years. And if you don't put the country ahead of your own political exigencies, uh, you would do what um, gets you elected, right? I'll build the bridge and I can point to a bridge or I'll build a road and I can point to a road. And so you are in that type of mode of economic development. But if you have to put in the systems for digitization, that infrastructure is soft infrastructure. You're building a national ID card, you're building a digital address system, uh, you're, you're doing all sorts of uh, things that may not be visible, but is more, might more important. You see, Baumia is a liar. Oh, sir, Baumia is a liar. He's saying, say, a year the digitalization, digitization, you have to do what? You have to build the, the systems. What are the systems? Or say African leaders in Junior Kwechi, Omo Ba, Power Nan Omo Pe, Omo Junior Systems, Obi in 2012. Obi in 2012, we see infrastructure. Well, what, 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 was starting your Ghana card or the all the government agencies at to a platform e services so what they are going to mean building one infrastructure when it comes to digitization you have a problem with that person oh sir kwawi he is mentally not straight oh sir he could not give any answer because he has not contributed to digitization in Ghana he has not invested in it he is basically what he's doing is almost we have updated this app when you update an app, you have not built or invested in infrastructure. You have not built and invested in digitization. So this guy could not even answer the question. So when he goes out there and he's claiming digitization, you know, when you are claiming digitization, show me what you have done. And yet digital-wise, when it comes to application, and digital-wise, when it comes to infrastructure, these two, if you are not able to point to one, you are mad. You are not supposed to be somebody we, are less, we listen to. answer. You don't understand the job. So be from 2009, it will say a building, a digital card, 
a digital Ghana card. I will say I see a fiber optic cable for from 2012. I will say I see a data center. I will say I see the government agencies, you know, business, any government to me, Juma Boom, we are building platform to put all of them there working effectively. Now the hotel worker systems. What systems are you talking about? What systems are you talking about? You are calling infrastructure, says soft infrastructure. You are crazy. You don't understand the digitization. Look around here. Baumia is or you cooked edio bofro or you cooked momone. Baumia is empty. Messi Mahmoud Baumia. How did you come to know Baumia? Yes, why economist? Yes, on the on the day, Sika won some any or my boom won some and a internal about politics. And it's an MPP for Kofani Free Bank of Ghana. And yeah, then and the Baumia characterization. And yeah, then and the Baumia on Pesobeka economy won some because he has failed. He's not smart. He's not intelligent. Or do you say Jimmy? He is coming to come and talk digitization, digitization. Abra, before he got into politics, people have taken initiative to start building our digital, dig, 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 digitalization sector, no? or our digital revolution. No? John Mahama was starting. Mr. Ochino, but TV Swa. Now, so we be here and look at digitization because hey, hey, stay there, stay, stand there. Digitization, what do you mean by digitization? We cable, fiber optic cable, or layer, and they to me send the text away. You are talking about an app you have built or you are talking about digitization and Ghana card. Because the people who lay the fiber optic cable, no, almost yeah, yeah, no, and the moon say I was here then you to be moving every government institution and businesses onto a platform. This is your guy who wants to lead. This is the Baumia, Endra Mutin in Simbiobekai before I pay calls. To hear what I will do by God's grace if elected as the next president of Ghana. My vision is built on the same philosophy, but pursues some different parts, which I believe will make our nation great and strong. Join me, and let's together get Ghana moving. Eh, on Wednesday. I say, on Nam Ekufuado, obey you see the same philosophy, different paths. Or you're confused. Now I say a the philosophy, no. Philosophy you and Ekufuado built for eight years. Sanka your papa with your supporter. And can you take a different path? Wait, Jimmy for <laughs> you built a philosophy with the Kufuado. You came in with a Kufuado, built a government, built a philosophy. Why are you leaving his philosophy to go to go create a new path? Because you have helped Ekufuado to destroy this country. Because your leadership, Ekufuado trusted you. Ekufuado thought, sir, wouldn't you answer? Cronona Oboma Kufu, Emanikwa, a redenomination, not just obey to my Biamano. Nana, no, Nimsa Sakron, no crown, obey the free America, be a mao, nay, your wa. In Tommy, the vice president, the mano, Omuja economy, and Nomsa won't know Niminansa. Now you have run this economy into the ditch. You are turning around to tell us new path. I now won't know. I'll say a jacket root yao. May try watch na me. The loud silence media team, we are waiting for you tomorrow. I'll come tomorrow. Every single word you will say, maybe change your Ghana for. At Trubia, I will let Ghanaians know. Never go close to digitization. And the Ghana for you, me, I am waiting for you. I am waiting for you. Mahmoud Baumia, myself and my team, Every single person on Loud Silence TV, we are waiting for you with the facts. You be to near the Unyeni papa pa won You are not supposed to come close to any power in Ghana. Assemblyman could You are a liar. You have dragged Ghana. You have declined Ghana. You have retrogressed Ghana for about 50 years. You are a disease. You are a liar who does not deserve to go close to our Jubilee House. Mahamudu Baumia, me, me brewase. I'll let your own mother, I'll let your own family see you and spit on you until you change your ways and become a good Muslim who speaks truth. You will not have space in Ghana politics.